All right, for this problem, we're given this triangle and asked to find the measure of the angle indicated. So the angle indicated is this angle here that is labeled theta. Now, we know that this is a right triangle because of this little uh, square here in angle C. So if, uh, if this is a right triangle, then we don't have to worry about the law of sines or the law of cosines or anything like that. This is going to just be Sokotoa. Uh, that sine is equal to opposite over hypotenuse, cosine is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse, tangents equal to opposite over adjacent. So here, um, in, in terms of this angle, we know it's adjacent side, and we also know the hypotenuse. The hypotenuse is always the side that's directly across from our right angle. So if we know the adjacent and the hypotenuse, we're going to want to use the cosine, because the cosine of our angle theta is going to be equal to the length of the adjacent side, which is 8.4, divided by the length of the hypotenuse, which is 15. Now we just need to set, uh, solve for theta. So in order to solve for theta, we need to uh, take the inverse cosine of both, si both sides. Uh, so that's going to give us theta is equal to the inverse cosine of 8.4 divided by 15. Then we can plug that into our calculator and we're going to get that theta is approximately equal to 55.9 degrees. And we're asked to uh, round this to the nearest tenth.